Welcome back to World of Warcraft, Wrath of the Lich King. We are oh, so close to defeat and so close to victory. I don't know what it's going to be. I guess we'll find out. Let's take a look at Jaina and Moradin, see where they stand, and then we're going to be starting off with Jaina. All right, so as it sits, Jane is down to two health. So yeah, she's going to have to be doing some healing. She's got a fight card of one, a travel card of two, a defend of two, and a free heal action. Morden's at full health with a couple of defend cards. I think we know what we're going to be doing with him. He's going to be the quest master this episode if we don't you know, fail first. All right, let's go over to Jaina and have her take her turn. Okay, the first thing we're going to do with Jaina, you can do a rest action in a space with enemies. It does not matter. She has to do a rest action because she is too beaten up. So we're going to see how many fish she can roll uh, for healing. She's only at two health. So her first action, so she heals two. She's up to four. And I think... For her second action, she is going to do a fight action. See if she can get rid of the uh, abomination and a couple of ghouls. She does have a fight card and defend card. So she gets two fists. Uh, and with the two fists, she's going to add on her one fight card, which is three, which will get rid of the abomination. Uh, however, she's going to take two damage and she only has her one frost shield. She's going to go from four health down to three, leaving her a couple of actions left. And now I have to think about what she wants to do with her last two actions. Okay, her final two actions. She's going to do one more fight action because we need to get some ghouls back into the supply. Uh, so, her second to last action. Oh man, she only gets one hit. So one ghoul gets hit and she takes no damage. She has one action remaining. And I think her final action, she's going to move up here with the Lich King. Because if this, if I can get Moradin up there and he can complete the quest, we'll win the game. But that's not the end of things yet, um, because now we have to finish off Jaina's turn, and that might be a turn for the worst. All right, a little bit of damage control, but I don't know. All right, two cards for Jaina. I should also mention, if you go to draw cards and you can't draw any cards, for every card you cannot draw, the despair marker goes down as well. So she gets a fight two. Okay, okay. And another fight card. Fight one. All right. Oh, I was just really hoping we were not going to see another scourge card. And we didn't. However, we do have to pull three cards now. And this could get bad. Actually, <laughs> we only have three ghouls left in the supply, which is wow. <laughs> All right, let's pull the first card. What do we get? We have the Shadow Vault. Oh man! The Shadow Vault has got three ghouls already. So we have an overrun, which means the um, Despair Marker goes down one, and we're going to spawn a, an Abomination there. Well, that's great. <laughs> so there's the first card. Yeah, things, I don't know. The second card is Temple of Storms. <laughs> no! Another overrun. Despair Marker drops one. Our final abomination comes out here at the Temple of Storms. Ay, yay, yay. Third and final card is Wraith Gate. <laughs> All right, well, at least the Wraith Gate, it just goes up to three ghouls. That doesn't cause an overrun. Now abominations move. This abomination it makes his way right to Thuridan, giving him a damage, eight health down to seven. Okay, we can we can live with that. This abomination is going to go. Uh, oh yeah, there's equidistance, so it could have gone to Jaina or Thuridan. We're moving it to Thuridan. <laughs> this one's going to move here. This one, unfortunately, is going to move right up here with the Lich King. And Jaina, giving Jaina a damage, she's going from three health down to two. So things are getting completely ugly. I think the only way we can pull this off, from what I can see, is we have to have uh, Thoradin get up here uh, and finish the quest. <laughs> so, wow. And he has no means of fast travel or anything. All right, we're going to zoom down. We're going to have uh, Moradin. 
take his turn. All right, honestly, we have two ghouls left in the supply. We have all abominations out on the board. I think the only way we can pull this off is if we can complete the Ice Crown Citadel quest right now on Muradin's turn. Otherwise, I do believe we're just going to lose. We can only drop our Despair Tracker uh, three more times to lose. That's it. And unfortunately, we do not have a connecting space from this one to this one. And he has no fast travel cards at all. So Muradin has to uh, go on foot. One, two, and he's up here with Jaina, the Lich King, and an Abomination. The Abomination doesn't do anything in here. It will do something at the end of the turn, though, if it gets that far. I'm going to readjust the camera. Moradin's got two actions remaining, and they are going to be quest actions. If so, it's do or die. Let's get out the dice tray and, I don't know, see if we can pull this off. All right, well, at least Jaina's there to help him. She has basically... One of every card, and uh, Moradin's got two defense cards. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight successes. Oh, yay. I, I don't know. We got two shots to get eight successes. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, this is so close. All right, quest action. Come on, Moradin. Yes, he gets three. Oh, man, that is so exactly what we need. Oh, he is going to take three damage, though. Uh, so he's going to go from seven health down to four, which is livable. And we get to progress three. I guess I'll leave that there. So we're going to show the first card from Jaina is a uh, fast travel card. And that's going to make us move one. And then that's it. Ah, Jaina can't show two cards. Muradin can show two, but he only has shields. So three successes. One, two, three. We are one, two, three, four away from winning. Moradin has one final action. It's going to be a quest action. I think this game is going to come down to this roll of the dice right here. We're either going to succeed or fail. <laughs> Let's see what we get. Oh, I don't know if we did it. Oh, my God, dog. Don't even tell me. <laughs> Okay, I think we might be in a world of pain. Uh, well, all right. Jaina's going to show her attack card to progress it down one. And then we have two successes for Morden. One, two. <laughs> We're one. One space away. Oh, I don't even believe this. And Morden has to take three damage. He's going from four health down to one. <laughs> And there's nothing... Oh, no, he's he's got defense cards. What am I doing? He's going to use one of his defense cards to negate two, so he'll be sitting at three health. <laughs> well, he can... Yeah, okay, he's at three health. Oh, my God, that is the end. That's the end of his turn, and I think this might be the end of our game. Oh, no, we're one! One away. All right, I'm going to zoom out. We're going to finish off Morton's turn. I think this might be us being finished off, I'm pretty sure. All right, Moradin's going to be drawing two cards. Let's hope they are good ones, and they are a fight card. Yeah, and another fight card. Okay, so we didn't get... Oh, we didn't get another scourge card. Oh, hang on. Well, we have... Oh, my God. We have two... <laughs> we have two ghouls left in the supply. we got to pull three cards. Um, yeah, all right. So we have Azul Nurub, which is right here. All right. <laughs> Maybe we can win this yet. We get one ghoul. We have a second card, which is the Argent Tournament. Wow, we can pull... Oh my god. Three ghouls. We have no ghouls left. So this is going to cause our Despair Tracker to go down. If, unless it's an overrun. Frost Hold. Alright, so what happens? Frost Hold... I don't, I don't believe this. Frost Hold can't get a miniature. Because we don't have any left. For every miniature you cannot put on the board, the Despair Tracker goes to, down one. We're two away on the Despair Tracker from losing. And Abominations now move. Well, this Abomination is going to move. It's going to hit Moradin for one. He's going to go three health down to two. <laughs> so he's at two health. Jane is at two health. This Abomination is going to move in here. God, I can't even fit it in there. All right. And he's going to also hit Moradin for another health. Moradin from two health down to one. I'm glad we used that shield card or <laughs> we wouldn't be in trouble. This one now is going to move here. 
And I can't even believe this, but I do believe that's the end of the turn. So we didn't actually lose. We are so close. There's no miniatures left at all to put out on the board. Morgan's down to one health. Jane is down to two. I think we can just finish this off right now. Uh, and I think we're going to have... Well, just Jaina will be going next. First thing she's going to do is a quest action. She only needs one success, and she has a shield card. So we're going to readjust the camera. I can't even believe this. I don't know how we're going to pull this off, but maybe we just did. Oh, my good lord. All right, well, we can pull it off because Jaina's got attack cards. So... <laughs> see but she might get knocked out but i think we complete the quest first all right jana oh wow first action uh actually no her first action she's going to use the heal card because if she we don't want her to get knocked out so she's going to use her heal card she has it it's a free action boom she gets to heal uh, this plus uh so she's going to heal three she heals three she goes from two health up to five so she quaffs a healing potion, and now she's going to do her quest action. And I do think she gets two shields, two successes, and she's going to even use her defend. for. So she's going to have four defense, which means she's going to take no damage. And we progress the quest two, which means we, <laughs> we complete it, and we defeat the Lich King. I think we did that right. I, I can't believe this. Wow, did that ever come down to the wire? I guess we're going to zoom out and we're going to wrap up our playthrough. I hope I didn't make too many mistakes. I, I did make some along the way. Apologize for that. Check the comments, of course, in my videos. I think we just pulled this off. I, had, I did not think we were going to survive the end of the last round. Okay, so what started off as a relatively easy walk in the park had turned into an absolute mess at the end. But we, we did pull it off. We defeated the Lich King barely. We got, we got down to absolutely no miniatures in the supply. Every ghoul and every abomination's on the board. More than down to one health. This, wow, I, this was really, really close. I really did, I like that. The first half of the game seemed to be kind of, like I said, like a walk in the park, but man, does it ever ramp up. Uh, we only got through four of the Scourge cards of the six, and this is what's left of our hero deck. So we have quite a few hero cards left. Let's kind of see. So at the end of Jaina's turn would have been a fight card, a travel, and then the end of Norden's next turn. So where the heck's the next Scourge card? Wow, we didn't get another Scourge card. There it was for quite a while, but we had no miniatures, and our Despair Tracker was only two away from defeat. Wow, so thanks so much for watching along. I really enjoyed this. It's quite a good game. I think it's a pretty good gateway game. Introduce people into the hobby. It's not super difficult to figure out how to play, but boy, does it get, it does ramp up in difficulty. And when you start getting overruns and things happening, like you saw there at the end of the playthrough, you can lose pretty quickly. I still cannot believe we didn't actually lose at the end of Thoradin's turn there. Uh, that's just crazy, crazy fun. All right, thanks so much. And yes, I am trying my best to get playthroughs up uh, day after day. Uh, it's been a little bit tricky, uh, but I'm going to do my best. So we'll be starting up another playthrough again tomorrow, I hope. I cannot guarantee, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to try my best to do that. So once again, thanks so much for watching, Laura. Thanks for your comments, any of your subscriptions, and your likes. It really helps out my channel. I appreciate it. And we'll see you tomorrow for another playthrough series. I'm not 100% sure what I'm doing. I'm about 90% sure, but I won't tell you what it is. Check, out, check me out tomorrow, and you'll find out. So thanks so much. This was World of Warcraft, Wrath of the Lich King. I can't believe we won, but we did. Thanks so much. I'll see you tomorrow.